Hi everyone, I'm Amy with Book Chipping Amy, and today I'm doing a book haul. This will be my summer book haul. So I went a little crazy on Amazon purchases and got 19 books off Kindle, and I'm happy with every single one. The first one is Too Hot to Hold by Stephanie Tyler. I've been having this on my shelf for a long time to read, and I want to get into this series because I know it started has a spin-off series of it, and I think the first book in the spin-off series is about a writer, and I'm very interested in that, so I wanted to pick up her first book. The second book, I have it on my computer so make sure I say them right, is The Chief. One of my friends borrowed this and Rick has yet to turn it back into me. So I decided I just might as well get it on Kindle. I remember reading it and really, really enjoying it, but I didn't have time. And I have been getting the the NetGalley previews for the coming books and I'm going to review them, but I need to read the first couple books before I review the rest. So I have a clue what's going on in this series. So it's very important that I got this book and I'm very excited to read it. And the next one is This Side of the Grave by Janine Frost. This is part of the Night Hunter series. I just, a lot of these books that, I'm, that I purchased are just a continuation. I haven't caught up all the way, but they're just a continuation so I can keep up. And of course, you know I love her. She is awesome. She has awesome characters. Next book I bought was Robin D. Owens. I'm saying that right. Heart Thief. This is kind of like a dystopian kind of almost uh, world where it's like in the really future, it's in the far future and they're like almost, almost on another world but not. And it's just interesting and so I can't wait to read this. Apparently one of the characters is is asking for money and one of the characters is in, uh, in trouble for stealing something in the last book. You have to figure out what that is. The next book I got is Sweet Revenge with Christy Reese. I weirdly enough had the book, the Sweet series, the first one of the Sweet series and the last one of the Sweet series, and I had the middle of the Sweet the trilogy. Actually, it's a trilogy, and this is all part of the Last Chance Rescue series. You know I love the Last Chance Rescue series. It's amazing, and I love Ella Grace slash Christy Reese. Christy Reese, sorry. And she has awesome books, and so I'm actually almost, I think I'm like 70-80% through with Second Chances, so I hope I finish that this week. That would be fantastic. The next book I got was Bloodlines by Rochelle Mead. I felt really bad that I had this on my shelf and not on my Kindle. I love Rochelle Mead a lot. I read her Succubus Blues series, and I feel like I should read this because I loved her Vampire Academy. The Vampire Academy was my high school. Like, when I was high school, that's what I would read. I, I loved that series. So I'm going to start on this series, and I'm very excited to see some of my favorite characters. The next book I got is Eye of Heaven by Majori M. Lu. This is also a continuation of the Dirk and Steel series, and I'm very excited to read it. The next book I got was, it's actually a new series that I do not have, is Nancy Gideon's Chased by Moonlight. This is the second book in her series. This is about werewolves and um, kind of like a whole Louisiana type, type feel and about a detective and a werewolf and I'm very excited to read this. I love werewolves as you know. I love shapeshifters, werewolves, dragons, all that fun stuff which is why I'm writing a shapeshifter dragon story. Fun stuff. And so yeah I'm excited to read that and the next book I got was Cressley Cole's Dreams of a Dark Warrior. Actually, what I really wanted to have was Lothier. I wanted to have all the books up to Lothier. I hope I'm saying that right. And because I met him in the book, either the book before I, uh, the book I just read. And so I'm excited to read his book. Apparently that book is the one that sells the most. So I'm excited to read that book. The next book I got was Hidden Away, a KGI novel with Maya Banks. And I love her KGI series. It's really interesting, really unique, and I love reading it about strong buff, buff men, and you know, so I love this series. And of course, as you can see on the cover, he is very attractive, so yeah. And of course, I bought the first book in the Nancy Gideon series, Masked by Moonlight, and this is the first book of the Werewolf series, so I'm excited to read this one. I'm going to read this one before I read the second one, <laughs> so it's very important that I picked up the first one first. The next book I got was White Hot Kiss by Jennifer L. Armentrout, and this is a, I, I, what's really weird is the cover, I really thought it was 
a new adult novel, but apparently it is not. But that's okay. I've, I'm trying to get into more of the teen. I bought a Bloodlines, and that's technically not new adult. It is technically teen. And I'm excited to read this because it has about gargoyles. And I don't remember a book ever reading a book about gargoyles, so I'm very interested to learn a little bit about them. And, you know, she's an awesome writer, so I'm excited to read that. The next book I got was Reaver by Larissa Ione, and I felt sad that I didn't have this on my books bookshelf on my Kindle. I would go buy it in half price books and be like, oh it's so pretty sitting out there. I don't have it. So I had to buy it on my Kindle. That's my excuse. Even though I'm still not caught up, but I'm very excited to read this. I have been looking forward to this book for a long time. And the cover, let's just talk about the cover for a second. The cover is beautiful. I mean, come on, wings, the hot guy, come on, beautiful cover. And the next book I got was part of the Sentinel Wars by Shannon K. Butcher, or Shannon K., yeah, Shannon K. Butcher. And this was Falling Blind, part of the Sentinel Wars, and I'm very excited to read this. This is just another book that I bought, and this is part of the Sentinel, continuation of the Sentinel Wars. The next book I got was Touching Darkness by Janine, Jane, sorry, Jamie Rush. This is one of her special people series. I got the first, I think, three books, if this is not the third book. And I'm very excited to read it. This, she, I have I heard she has a new series out that's about dragon shapeshifters. So I'm excited. Once I finish this series of hers, I'm going to go to that series because that also sounds very interesting. The next book I got was Rule by J. Crownover. I hope I'm saying that right. This is about tattooed guys, and I don't read a whole lot of novels about tattooed guys. I just I don't know why I don't. I just don't. Uh, like some guys I read about will have like a tattoo marked on their sh shoulder or something to symbolize their, their devotion or like in, like a Black Dagger Brotherhood on their back they have their mates tattooed or scratched into their name or into their back. But this apparently, Rule is apparent, that's apparently his name, and apparently he's tattooed everywhere, and so I'm very excited to read about that. I've heard wonderful things about this book, and I can't wait to read it. And of course, I got another Cressley Cole book, because my book haul is not complete until I got a Cressley Cole book. And of course, I got Lothair, Lothair, I hope I'm saying that right. And this is the book I wanted to purchase up to, because I hear he is really cool, this is the best selling book, and in the description, I will put a link to a the art author signing where she and the cover model came up, and they got the actual person who was on the cover. You got to meet her, Presley Cole, and the guy who was on the cover. And apparently, he's on one of the covers of the Black Dagger Brotherhood. I think it, I'll put a picture right here of the actual um, the Black Dagger Brotherhood too, But I thought that was really cool. So in the description, if you want to go watch that video, it's really kind of funny. And so yeah, that's another book that I got. The second to last book I got was The Edge of Never by J.A. Oh goodness, Redemkarski? Hope I'm saying this name right. I'm so good with names. Anyway, I got this book, and this is the first book in that series, and The Edge of Always is also, I think, the second book. I didn't get the second book, though. I just got the first book. See? Restraint. I can do it. Anyway, I'm excited to read this book. This book's been on my shelf. Apparently, it's about a girl that goes on a road trip uh, on a bus and meets a guy, and then continuation. It's a new adult book. I'm excited to read it. And actually, I've heard great things from booktubers, and that's actually the reason why I decided to read this. And the last book that I got is Janine Frost, Once Burnt. Apparently, this is about Dracula. And I'm excited to read this because the book I just finished of hers is actually where uh, we get to meet Dracula. Or, and I'm so excited to meet him. I've been wanting to get on this series for a long time because I've heard wonderful, wonderful things about this series. And I'm like, I haven't met the main character. I feel really bad about reading it, and I'm afraid there's going to be spoilers. And so I'm excited to read this because I, I met the characters, so I hope I won't be too spoiled too much. So, so yeah, that's what I got. There is one more thing I'd like to mention. This is what I got on the on my on Amazon. I hope it gets into focus. Let's see, focus. Okay, this I got this from Keepers Cove. This is a really cool necklace. This is actually a necklace that I got for my story because in my story, the girl who wears this, whenever she gets takes off the necklace, she grows wings because she's a fallen angel. Spoilers. Anyway, this is the necklace that she wears. And I saw this and I was like, oh my goodness, I must have this. 
These, this company is an amazing company. I mean, this is not the only uh, key they have. And they didn't ask me to say anything about this, I promise. It's just I really wanted to show this. And I just, this is a really cool company. I'll leave their uh, Amazon or Facebook or something, or Pinterest. Etsy account in the description below. You really should go see some of their keys. If not, just to look at them because they are really, really pretty. And they have like awesome stuff and they left me a little note. And yeah, it's really cool. I love wearing this around everywhere. Only thing I don't like about it is the chain is super long and that goes down the back of my shirt. But other than that, I wear this all the time. I don't know why I decided not to wear this for the video. It's weird, but I really wanted to show this because I thought I got it the other day and I thought it was so beautiful. And it relates to books because this necklace is in my book. So, see? That's how it relates, re relates to the book haul. So that's all for me today. For the, in the question below, have you read any of these books? Should I read any of these, of these books right now? Or do you have any book suggestions? Always leave comments in the comments below. I love reading comments. And in the description, you'll find my social media links, Amazon account, and the cover art, cover model, and Cressley Co. meetup in the links to love below. And I think, and the, of course, Keepers Cove in the links below. You should go check them out. Really cool video and business, and they're really, really cool. So yeah, make sure to like, comment, subscribe, and as always, what do I always say? Go find your inner reader. See ya.